Sixers hosting the Clippers, and the Sixers are three and a half point favorites. The over under is at 215 and a half. I have the Clippers at plus 143 on the money line, and the Sixers at minus 170. The Clippers are on a two game winning streak. The Sixers are on a six game winning streak. The Clippers are 17 and 16 against the spread. The under is 21 and 12 in the games in which they played in, and they are 8 and 7 on the road this year. The Sixers are 8 and 12, 18 and 12 against the spread. Wow, forgive me. The under is 16 and 14 in the games in which they played in. They've been excellent at home. They are 13 and 5. Head to head, the road team is on a two game winning streak, although the home team is 6 and 4 in their last 10. The Sixers are 7 and 3 against the Clippers in their last 10. The favorite is 5-5 five five against the spread, while the favorite is 7-3 on the money line. The under is 6-3-1 in their last 10 meetings, and the over-under at 215.5 is 5-5. Five five. They haven't really scored a ton of points when these teams play each other. The last game that they played, the Sixers won 122-97. The game before that, the Clippers won 102-101. The game before that, the Sixers won 106-103. to The game before that, the Clippers won 122-112. And the game before that, the Clippers won 136 to 130. So those were the two games that were really like the higher scoring games in their last 10 meetings. Before you bet this game, go to Twitter, go to Underdog NBA, and make sure that this is actually accurate and there are no injured players and that maybe John Wall is or is not playing. I'm going to take the Sixers with the money line. I'm going to take the Clippers with the points, and I'm going to go under in this game and hope that it's a one-possession game and win by the hook. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.